back to my channel with my little music of construction tonight. I got a really cool video. I got a uh, book in the mail today, which I had five years ago, but I lost it in Canada, unfortunately. And uh, I got it five years later. This is. Black Metal Evolution of Cult, written by Dale Patterson. That's the front. And then the back. Uh, so, Black Metal Evolution of the Cult. Black Metal, the most extreme music of all. It's the listener alive. This book. Documents the genre's three decade journey with nearly 600 pages of photographs and interviews with members of Venom. Obviously, every model head knows Venom. Ritual Fate, Bathory, Hellhammer, Slash, Gothic Crossed, Volcano, Blasphemy, Samuel, Ron and Christ, Necromantia, Vaughn. Tormentor, Master Sammer, Behirt, Mayhem, Thorns, Dark Throne, No Shield Sever, Slash Emperor, Gehenna, Gorgoroth, Trotum, Crotal Filth, Demiborgir, Mutilation, Marduk, Funeral Mist, Shonin, Graveland, Infernum, Behemoth, Enslaved, Isengard, Storm, Over, Windir, Ingurabunga, Hades, Primordial, Arcturus, Manis, Flirty, Sai, Donum's Guard, Miscum, Alborim, Black Lodge, Fen, and many more. Um, yeah, uh, just go through the book. Alright, so let's go. Let's just uh, start, shall we? Here's the inside. It's a uh, great, great book. Uh, yeah, 2013, Zill Patterson. So. Yep, but I'm really happy to have it five years later, uh, or seven years later, actually. Introduction page, um, one, Roots of Evil, basically talking about what pretty much influenced Black Metal, and Black Sabbath, even though they're not Black Metal, they're a dead metal band. Um, two, Venom, obviously, Black Metal, uh, Virtual Fate. Bathory, Hellhammer, Call the Cross, the first wave of Black Thrash, Blasphemy, Canadian Black and Death Metal, Samuel, Switch Black Metal, now Industrial Black Metal, Run Christ and Great Black Metal, Tormentor, Black Metal Early, Industrial Black Metal, Black Metal Now, uh, Master Samur, Black Metal, they've always been a Black Metal band, More Abbott Guard Black Metal Now though, <clears throat> Vaughn, American Black Metal, still Black Metal, uh, Bahira Black Metal, I don't think they released anything, apart from Mangram, which is like 11 years ago, um, Mayhem, Part 1, obviously, Legends, Mayhem, Part 2, uh, Rebirth of a Movement, Norway, Part 1, and Fist in the Face of Christianity, Norway, Part 2, Death of Legend, Nari Part 3, and then Thorns, Black Metal Early, Industrial Black Metal, now, um, Dark Throne, Black Metal, Burzum, uh, Black Metal Early, Non Metal Now, it's Ambient Music, um, Emperor, Black Metal, no longer a band though, uh, Gehenna, Black Metal, I think they're still going. 
Gargaroth, uh, Black Metal, they're still going. Scrotum, a Black Metal, uh, Goals First Band. The Opus Magnum, Mayhem Part 3. The Beast Ray Awakens, Mayhem Part 4. Uh, Curl of Filth, Black Model Androids in Mainstream Part 1, still going. Demon Borgir, Black Model Androids in Mainstream Part 2, still going. Underground Ethics, all about Underground Black Model. Lost Legends, No Errors. Mordix, Sweden Part 1, still going. Um, Dissection and Retain, Sweden Part 2. Section is disbanded like years ago. Uh, I don't mean years and years ago, but 14 years ago. What Tain's still going, which is a great black metal band that every black metal band knows. Shonen, uh, Depressive, Suicidal, Black Metal. They're awesome. Uh, politics, well, into the rise of National Socialist Black Metal. I love a lot of that stuff. Um, Graveland and Infernum, Polish Black Metal Part 1. Graveland Square Band, Infernum I know a little bit, Behemoth, Polish Black Model Part 1. Even though they had Death Model elements, I do consider them a Black Model Band. Because Black and Death Model is still a genre of Black Model. It's basically Death Model with Gorse Band, if you get what I mean, and Satanic Lyrics. Slaved, Folk and Folk on Black Model. Just released an amazing new album. Uh, Still somewhat black metal. Me and Falcon Over, Falcon Folklore and Black Metal. Early over is black metal, uh later era over is like ambient music. Um the prof the proliferation of black folk metal. Folk and folklore and black metal part three. I like a bit of that stuff, especially early satirical and I love. Uh satirical in general is great. A Truth of Wear Part 1, A Truth of Wear Part 2, so I, our list of, obviously, Black Metal, usually influenced by Mayhem and Hellhammer, uh, Black Metal, again, which is awesome, Dottom Scarred, Black Metal, Early Industrial Black Metal, Mysticum, Industrial Black Metal, Aborum, Industrial Black Metal, Black Lodge, Industrial Black Metal, Left Lover, Industrial Left for a post black model, post black model part two, which is Arcturus, which formed as a traditional black model band actually. Uh, see, so I'll check that. All says to you. Yeah, so all says, uh, formed as a black model band in two thousand and one. Uh, released a demo called Chris DC. Ever know? Uh, I've listened to it before. Yeah, it's amazing. It's a lot better than their uh, later era stuff. If you want to go back to their early stuff, that's definitely one to check out. Uh, 
Black Sabbath, uh, is definitely not black metal, but I mean, the imagery influenced a lot of black metal, and Judas Priest is also not black metal, but again, the imagery influenced a lot of black metal, and matter of fact, it actually influenced uh, Dima Borger's early, uh, first few albums, first three albums, being for all dead, Storm Bless, and Throne Drugs Triumphant. Which is obviously their best stuff. Kelvin, obviously not black metal, it's steam metal. But the image really influenced black metal, and Black Sabbath definitely influenced black metal. Imagery wise, uh, municipally not at all. And then the band that pretty much started it all, uh, for Black Metal, which is Venom, and I definitely agree with that, uh, I've been a massive Venom fan since I was five, so yeah, they go way back for me. Their 1981 classic, to be a full length album, which I own on CD since 2018, yep. It's a classic. And then Venom Black Model, uh, which I also own on CD. Got it in uh, January of 2019. It's a classic. Early photo of Venom, original lineup, which sadly no longer exists. I prefer the early stuff a lot more than Fallen Angels. Um, Merciful Fate, uh, musically speaking, it's not black metal. But amateur wise, it definitely is part of a lot of black metal bands. Discretion of Souls, Pursue of Fate, Live for the Lamar, Venue in York, November 1984. Photo Frank White. The debut for my album, Melissa, uh, obviously not black metal, it's heavy metal, but the imagery definitely influenced black metal. Second falling album, uh, Don't Break the Oath, amazing album, great album, classic, absolutely. And then we get to probably the band that pretty much started uh, a trim or black metal uh, sound is Bathory. Been a massive fan since 2006, uh, realistically, because I didn't really know him in 2005. Uh, Bathory, Bathory, their self titled debut for my album, which I have on CD. It's amazing. And a interview with Corthon and the second album, The Return, or, uh, the full version is The Return of the Dark and Disney Evil, which is also a song called The Return of the Dark of the The Return of Darkness and Evil on this uh, particular album. So they just shortened it to the return to make it easier. Under the sign of the Black Mark, one of the greatest black model albums ever made.
in my opinion. It's like the first stuff I heard, uh, back when it goes way back for me. Um, Hellhammer, Switch, Black and Thrash Metal, Proto Black Metal, whatever you want to call it. Square stuff. Elvis Legendary Band. He was actually, uh, really cool, they actually reformed as a live band last year. Um, Hellhammer Front Death Demo 1983, and uh, Tom's Warrior in the um, rehearsal bunker during the recording for Front of Death Demo. The legendary Satanic Rites Demo, amazing uh, demo. Love it. And have been a fan of it since I was a kid. So, yeah. Apocalyptic Rates. Uh, awesome. Uh, awesome, awesome EP. And a uh, picture in front of their rehearsal space as well, which is really cool. Let's hold that up. There we go. This book's like really, really thick, which I love. And obviously, a band that I've been listening to for a very long time. Uh, Kill the Cross, been a fan of since 2006. Promotional photo sheet there. And, uh, Cut the Crossed, Morbid Tales, obviously a black model classic that needs no introduction. Watch I own on CD. I uh, have it. I've had it since 2016, so four years. Into the Pandemonium, uh, great album. Bought it uh, last year in 2019. Amazing album. Very different, don't black model at all, but it's a really good album. And then we get to the formation of uh, Triple Killing. One of my favorite black metal bands. I do consider them to be a black metal band, definitely. First wave of Black Thrush, Chapter 7, which includes Sodom, which early stuff is black metal, later stuff is just traditional Thrush. Uh, Sodom Obsessed by Cruelty, uh, definitely influenced Inquisition, um, Clutter and Spain, got it in 2014, so I've had it for like six years now, which is crazy. And I still listen to it, because it's one of those albums that just gives you a nostalgia feel from your childhood. Uh, Critter, 1982, and Destruction, which I have a patch, if you've seen all my Battle Jacket video. And, um, Slayer's Show No Mercy, which is definitely a black metal. Uh, I did consider Slayer's Show No Mercy to be a black metal album. Volcano, Bloody Vengeance, Brazilian Black and Thrash, and Sarkovka Rodin, another Brazilian Black and Thrash model, uh, classic. Then get to Canadian Sarkovka. That's Sarkovka there. 
again we get to the Canadian block and Death Metal Legends Blossomy. Here we go. Uh, Fallen Angel of Doom, Amazing Black and Death Model Classic, Running Christ, Immortal and Blasphemy Door for Europe. I love Blasphemy, I've uh, been a fan since 2013. Um, Gods of War, the second album, and a picture there. Really cool. Blasphemy, yeah. Um, Samuel, amazing band. Obviously, the early self is black model. Samuel, uh, medieval prophecy, EP 1988. Early stuff is so freaking sick. What's the pen? The debut full length album and ceremony of opposites is still black model. Then they dropped the black metal tag and went industrial with uh anti-god. Which I do like, but honestly the early stuff was the best. It's a lot darker, it's a lot more metal. And there we go, Samuel Melakesh and keep a listen. Melikish is obviously black model. Sammy always knows, but what are you gonna do? Uh, Rotting Christ and great black model. Rotting Christ is uh, first logo. Uh, started as a grindcore band, believe it or not. This is their black model stuff. Ronnie Cross's first ever demo. And then Ronnie Cross nowadays, which is pretty awesome. Still doing it, still perfecting black metal. Uh, Tomator, Hungarian black metal. Seventh Day of Doom and I don't know Domine. That's the re-released version. And Tom and Roar now it is. Uh Brady Band out of the out of the Czech Republic. Master's Hammer. Awesome black metal. This picture and the first ever demo. Uh, finished. Not finished. <laughs> uh, the mass demo, 1989. Master Samurai nowadays. Avon, uh, American Black Model. Live nineteen ninety one. Satanic Blood uh, demo version and Satanic Blood album version. Vaughn nowadays. Vaughn nowadays. And Behirit, uh, one of my favorite Finnish Black Metal bands.
first ever, but here are our demo. Early photo and the also black blood. Twenty six minutes. Twenty six minutes of just pure freaking brutal black metal head. And uh, nuclear holocaust of vengeance there. Nuclear Holocaust of Vengeance 2009. Going to Mayhem now. It's Mayhem Part 1. It's an early photo. Another early photo there. And then the first demo. Uh, Pure Armageddon and Death Crush. Or is it Death? Yeah, it's Death Crush. Death Crush EP, 1987. Mayhem Part 2. Early photos with uh, Dead. And there we go. Get Clark for Love and Lipstick, which I own on City. Obviously a classic album. And Love and Lipstick. Uh, Rebirth of Mirvan, Normal Part 1. Photo there. Advertisement for Hullabit Records and Devlex Songs Productions. I've been to Hullabit Slash Music Blood Records in Norway last year. We're on a mess in the Hellbit uh, store. There's a lot of history again. It's so cool. Um, there we go. Uh, more like items. It's basically some of the items that were in the shop that I've actually seen myself as well. Fits in face Christianity, Nora for two. Euronymous and uh, Brock Brokenness. Yes, it did happen very sadly. Euronymous. And then the uh, Karen uh, Black Model issue and Deathful Legend Normal for 3. Murder of Euronymous. Yep. Uh, 
basically just the news headlines. That's the news headline there. New said one there. I'm gonna get into thorns, another great black mall then. This is the Front Darnton Foot. Hog Skull for Darnton Folk High School. Yeah. Uh, it's a great band. Um, Thorns versus Emperor split in 1999. Thorn Thorns, the beautiful length and thorns there. And uh legendary girl throne right there. Dark Throw logo. Dark Throw on First Event of Hunger and Bloods in Northern Sky and on our Fitter Moon, which it used to have. Dark Throne Live, Onslow Norway, 1996. Inside Nature Blood Records and, and uh, Dark Throne's Black Flags. Then you get into Burzum. Mark Rickness and a cassette tape there. Burzum Oscar AP, which uh, is an origin for Ashes. this up so down it is a picture of venom which is very cool so they're all just uh, photos of uh, venom love in Norway 2010 merciful fate love in New York 1984 Corthon, uh, Bathory, Hallhammer. It's called the Cross. Volcano and uh, Blasphemy.
So blasphemy, uh, and Samuel. Mr. Zimmer and Big Hurt. Mayhem. Mayhem there. Mayhem and Emperor and Burzum. That's pretty much get the picture, man. Persian and uh, drop thrown there. Emperor. And a pre emperor band, actually. Emperor and Gehenna. Gorgoroth and Gehenna. Gorgoroth there. Cruel Filth and uh, Mayhem. Demon Borgir. More underground black metal. Mutilation and uh, Mardik. Section and within within Shonen, Behemoth, and Infernum. Enslaved, one year, over Nicaragungit, soy. Gum and Doran's Guard.
Mais c'est comme... Industrial Black Metal. And Wolves in the Throne Room. And Emperor. Emperor there. It's for the Torrent demo. It's Emperor and Girl Phil Thor. And the Knights of Eclipse. It's an Emperor logo. It's an Emperor, picture of Emperor there. Emperor 1997. The Emperor Anthem uh, Prometheus. First reunion 2006. Gehenna for a spell Melis Gorgoroth. Almost through here. Antichrist. Gorgoroth there. Throw them. Mayhem Part 3! Mayhem Part 4 Mayhem
my head in there. Mayhem. We're going to add a KO album. Curl Filth. Demon Borg gear. Almost done that. I'm going to draw on ethics. Oh, I call it 666. Make a I don't know what it is. Evil faced. Miss Visions and Wires. Middle Edition of Black Tepes. Mordix Widen Part 1 Is this allowed? Murdoch's first demo and uh, picture there. Mortis of Murdoch. Advertising for a gig. My section and with ten. My ten right there. And there. Shining mm -hmm. 
shown in there. Pulling in the rise of National Sources Black Metal. I can't freaking keep up in. Thor's hammer. Graveland and Infernum. Revlin there. Behemoth and uh, Polish Black Metal. Slaves, folk, and folk black metal. Enslaved and folk black metal. Moonfog and over. Revelation of Folk Folk Rock and Roll 2. We are almost freaking done. Hit it, Almighty. Got a grip end. Turn for the Weird Part 1. More ten. We're already running the fifty five minutes, so we forget. Right. Have to freaking wrap it up here.
silly. Virtually freaking hurry it up. Dorham's guard. Dottom's guard. Hurt. I didn't realize this was taking like way too long. Mr. Khan. Borum Borum. We're nearly into a freaking hour. Holy freaking crap. Alright. Black Lodge. Freaking ball corners today, can we get uh, all right. post black model part one? Oh my god, I'm already into an hour now. Uh, post black bottle, part two. All right. 
three. Uh, and afterward. And then acknowledgements. And then just all the stuff. Wow, that was like my longest video yet, man. Uh, so yeah, um, sorry for keeping the gate for making a rather long video. Next video will be only like 13 minutes, uh, which will be tomorrow. Yeah, I just wanted to get that out there. Uh, so yeah, next video will be. Uh, another Zero Drones magazine video with Enslaved. And yeah, uh, until then, I'll see you guys later.